Hi, my name is Danny Anderson. Whenever you introduce yourself to somebody, don't you typically say something like that? Hey, I'm Danny, I'm Steve, I'm Mike. Why? Well, we want people to get to know us so they can relate to us, we can relate to them, we want to know their name. And today in Devos with Pastor Danny, as we continue our series on the Lord's Prayer, we're talking about the first petition of the Lord's Prayer, meaning the first section, hallowed be thy name, as we pray that to God. We're saying, Lord, would your name be kept holy among us? We honor, we revere, we highly regard your name and we value your name. And why is knowing and respecting someone's name necessary um, for a meaningful relationship? Well, it shows that person, whenever you take the time to get to know their name, that they matter, that they, they're deemed worthy in your eyes of being somebody you want to honor and respect. And as followers of Jesus, we want to honor God's name. Um, he, he, you can't separate God from his name. Uh, in his name, uh, that he proclaims love and mercy and he gives us faith. Um, we're, we're baptized in the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. The name of God matters. And so today, I want to ask you, in what ways can you honor the name of God today? Is it in your actions? Is it uh, as you care for your kids? Or as you um, interact with your coworkers? How can you honor God's name today? Um, you see, God's name is, tells us who He is, what He does, and it shows us his very presence among us, as Luther has said. Um, Isaiah 42 says, I am the Lord, that's my name. My glory I give to no other, nor my praise to any carved idols. Um, Exodus 20, 24, In every place where I cause my name to be remembered, I will come to you and bless you. And then Matthew 18, verse 20, For where two or three are gathered in my name, there I am among them. So how can we honor God's name? We can be, speak truthfully to who God is and what he's done. Uh, just tell the truth about God. You can just tell a story to other people. Hey, this is how God has worked in and through me. Um, and we can let our light shine to others, as Matthew 5 or 16 says, so that they may see your good works, meaning God's good works, and give glory to your Father who's in heaven. And so we want to just honor God by honoring his name. Hallowed be your name. It means when we're praying that, it means, Lord, you are so worthy of our honor and our praise and our glory. Uh, and and so, Lord, we, we give you glory and praise. And so that's what we do. That's why we hallowed God's name, because of what God has done for us as he sent Jesus, a name that is above every name, to give us his grace and his mercy. Well, friends, I hope you uh, have a great rest of the day. We'll uh, check out the second petition of the Lord's Prayer next week.